Hello friends, in this quick tutorial, I'm going to show you how to download and install Discord on a Windows PC. Okay, so let's get started. Open your browser and start typing Discord into Google. Now go to the first search result. You'll end up on this page, okay? Now, if you are on a Windows PC, you'll see this white button, download for Windows. Go ahead and click on this button and the Discord installation setup program will start downloading in your browser. Now, just wait for a while and you'll see this Discord setup file. Go ahead and click on this file and go through installation steps. I'm gonna minimize this window. Okay, I already have Discord installed. So running the setup will simply update Discord to the latest version. But if you're installing Discord for the first time, you'll see a regular installation process. So here it is, it's updating my existing Discord application. Now, once the installation or update process is complete, you'll see this window. It's going to ask you to register a Discord account. So I'm gonna go ahead and register a new Discord account by clicking on the, this register link at the bottom. It's going to bring me to this screen. So let's just go ahead and enter your email. Once you enter your email address, go to the next field and enter your display name. That's how you will appear in Discord chat on servers. Next, enter your username. And once you chose a good username, drop down to the next field and enter your password. Make sure to come up with a pretty good password that's secure. Now, select your birthday. Now, if you're not 13 years old yet, you'll need a permission with your parents. Okay, so let's go ahead and confirm that we are not a robot. Here's the test is going to ask me select a treasure. So just click on the treasure chest on the image below. And on the second screen, do the same thing. Select the treasure chest. Your test can be slightly different. So just read the instructions. And that's it. You are on the Windows desktop Discord app. Now you can close this window. Now, if you're registering for the first time, you'll see this purple message. Streamer mode is enabled. Usernames have been truncated. I have no idea what that means, but just click on the disable button and you'll see this green message. Please check your email and follow the instructions to verify your account. If you did not receive the verification email, click on this resend button here. Okay, guys, at this point, you want to open your Gmail inbox or your email account and click on this verify email address for Discord message you received. Click on a blue button. You'll see a message email verified and just click on continue to Discord, which will bring you back to your desktop PC app. And there you have it. You've just downloaded and installed Discord on PC. Now you can start creating new servers. So just click on this green button here with the plus. Go to create my own. Go to for me and my friends. Now give your server a good name and click on the create button. Or you can also upload an avatar for your server. Just choose an image and press the create button. Okay, now that you created a new Discord server, you'll see here under general, there's a button to the right, create invite. So if you click on this button, you'll be given a link, which is an invite link to your server. So just share it with your friends. You'll notice it says your link will expire in seven days. Click on this checkbox here to make sure that this link never expires. Copy this link and send it over to your friends. When your friends join, you'll see them on the right hand side under online users. There's going to be a new user list tab on the right. Okay, so now you can just send messages in your server. Here I'm going to say I've just downloaded and installed Discord on a Windows PC. Press enter and send that message to the server. Okay, guys, and that's pretty much how you download and install Discord on a Windows PC.